to lower the crane on my mark. I don't know how this thing works. I do not care. Be ready. Nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years. Not since the grand culling of the worms. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me. 
You are mistaken. The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows. Straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Um... Thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh... Ooh, not that. Um... Have you seen my brother again? Yeah. He said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No. I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No. Over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No. And uptight. Fussy! I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any- Ah! Burn that. I do not have time for this. No, 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 wait, 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 wait! I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. Watch where you grab that. Oh, ah, uh, never mind. Oh, so unclean. Oh, so so unclean. Oh, oh, the smell. Perfect. That should do. Oh. Yeah, I am not touching that. Just hold it out. <laughs> now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, uh, gently, now. Whoa. Oh, sure. Now you're impressed. Um, oh, how do I explain this? I added a new vibrating... Oh, oh I see. You figured it out on your own then. Just, never mind. artistry of my craft or anything. No, just anything to help you. Yep. Feels like it wasn't that long ago we were hunting deer. Now we've fought dark elves, and trolls, and ogres, and a dragon. I feel like we could be anything now. We win because we are determined, disciplined, not because we feel ourselves superior. another crystal around we could use on those roots. There we go. Want me to shatter it? Oh, I'm gonna like this. Strange, though. That one didn't completely go up. 
That crystal, I shot it once, but it's glowing again. Now it's stuck on the other side. I will never get tired of shattering things with this. going in the journal.
Here, boy. Another one. This one's called Emu. Mother tried to tell me this one. <laughs> Are giants coming out of the trumpets? I think that might be Odin stabbing him. What's that? Andreas, follow me. Be right there. It's getting colder. We must be near the top. <gasps> Not long now, Mon. River. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. A broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Steady, boy. Mind your footing.
there must be some way up. You hear those voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. Tell me. How about chill? You know why we're here. The last visit managed to loosen your tongue. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. He brought company this time. It must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me. You two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. Boy, well, we took their path. Make sure we're all alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just given time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard, it's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body from these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. 
This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Mother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy. The longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Huh? So you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. You know. 